Hey guys, HalfCab123 here from HalfCab123.com. Uh, today what I have for you is the Sensation 4G. Uh, what we have done is we are now providing a service for the HTC One X uh, port for it, which is Sense 4.0, Ice Cream Sandwich uh, 4.0.3. I'm rebooting the phone right now to show you the boot animation. And let's see if you guys can see it here. It's just the HTC screen right now. But it says HTC One and Beats Audio, of course. So this is going to come with Beats Audio and uh, the the port for Sense 4.0. So this is a completely fully functional ROM Sense 4.0 Ice Cream Sandwich 4.03, and we're doing this via remote session. Um, so if you guys want to get this done for you instead of having to go out and find all the files and everything, and 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 basically, uh, you know, you could mess up your phone even. You never know. So um, we're we're doing this. We're supporting uh, over a thousand customers now, right now, with the uh, Android Android phones. Uh, we're doing all you know support sessions and everything over the internet. It's halfcab123.com is the website. Just want to show you a little bit about Sense 4.0 right now. Um, excuse me, I'm in my car, so it's a little bit hard to show you guys this. Um, it's loading up right now, as you can see. Um, basically, what happened was. Google sent out uh, a requirement to manufacturers that said, "You guys are more than welcome to, um, you know, provide your own software overlays, uh, i.e., Sense or you know, um, TouchWiz, things like this. But we not require, but would appreciate it or recommend uh, that with the new software, you please kind of accommodate to look more like AOSP or stock ice cream sandwich." So what you can see here, um, this is Sense 4.0. It's kind of like a gingerbread uh, style dock at the bottom, and it has the ice cream sandwich uh, buttons down there. Um, so everything is pretty much formatted like ice cream sandwich AOSP from the Nexus. Um, and it has, let's, let me show you here. And they even have the pop-up menu, just like ICS stock. So it's, it's, it's a step more towards... Uh, total stock ICS in my opinion and I, and also much faster better on battery life because they've basically decluttered since they've gotten rid they've you know deflated it completely it was this huge overburdening processor hog it pre in previous form so now we have coming out is faster phones with less hardware intensive software um, at least in the processing department maybe not so much in the graphics department but that's okay um, but of course, the sensation 1.2 gigahertz is going to handle this this software uh, just perfectly fine. Um, so there you are, uh, Sense 4.0. Let me show you here. Uh, the app drawer now side scrolls, just like Ice Cream Sandwich it doesn't have that effect that Ice Cream Sandwich does, but it does side scroll. Um, the settings menu, uh, let's see, looks just like Ice Cream Sandwich. It's formatted just like Ice Cream Sandwich. Of course, you probably you might not be able to see there, but. Um, and there's a new f a tweak or feature where it does this separation between horizontal planes when you're in the menus um, instead of uh, the ICS or Android like orange or blue flash that we've seen in gingerbread, honeycomb, and ICS. Um, so they got they did not incorporate the flash, but instead went with this separating of horizontal columns, which I think is or horizontal uh, horizontal options, which I think is pretty interesting. Um, but so basically you're going to get all the HTC widgets and everything that comes with Sense 4.0 and you're going to get this early. And obviously the sensation is never going to receive this officially. Uh, Sense 3.6 is, is in the works right now official for an official ICS update, which we have no word on when that's going to be coming out. Uh, Cyanogen mod team has expressed their opinion that they think that ICS should be officially rolling out to phones sometime uh, after summer. So. Um, that's just their opinion. There's no official word on that, but the the leader of, of Sanjamad has close relations with Samsung, uh, so I would I would assume that you know they've they've probably got a pretty good idea of, of where they're coming. Not that this is a Samsung phone, but I would assume that all the manufacturers are probably you know probably progressing at near the same rate. So <clears throat> basically, uh, the camera works. Everything works. If you guys want to get this done to your phone, come on, come on down to halfcab123.com. We're helping folks uh, out there that really want to get involved. And really want to get the newest software and be running the latest stuff, but they don't necessarily know how or have the means to find the software and the methodology, or maybe don't understand the XDA threads or can't get help from people on YouTube or online. Uh, you know, we're here to provide support via chat, email, 
uh, phone if necessary. Um, and, and we do it all via our website. It's a very unique service. We've been around for about a year now. Uh, about 4,000 phones rooted since 2010, December. Uh, so come on down to halfcab123.com and get your sensation running since 4.0. Thanks, guys. You have a great day, and we really hope to hear from you. Thanks.